Hi guys, just a quick video on updating you on the DYS 3-axis gimbal that I've been working on for a while now. Uh, I've actually had a chance to get something done to it. Uh, what I've managed to do is, hope you can see, I'm trying to lift it up. Um, uh, I don't know if this will zoom in or not. Yeah, it will. I uh, just noticed in there that I've actually took the, the front of, of that out with a hacksaw uh, so now that the, sh the, the groove that runs through the top bar uh, there now goes the whole way through the front a lot easier for putting your um, um, wires and all that through um, also um, I've added the new um, HDMI to uh, AV out uh, card there. I've still got some wires hanging about to tidy up. Also added the new um, 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 DYS three axis gimbal. Try and get in there so you can see it. Um, you no longer have to. Um, Add the pins as you normally would. Um, you just plug it in, some self adhesive tape there, pull that off, plug it down, hold it in place. You now have your yaw pins on the actual main board. Um, pitch and roll. Um, that's about it so far. Um, it's mounted now on my um, turret. 810. Let's give it a quick power up um, so you can see it running and hopefully then anybody needing my uh, PIDs um, just ask at my on the forum and um, I can post everything there but these are only bench tested settings um, but they should be okay for flight but then again, nothing is uh, carved in stone. Looks good on the bench, put it in the air, and it can be a bag of shit. Um, that's it so far, guys. Anyway, thanks for watching. Um, I've still got some tidying up here to do, but it's just a case of waiting on the weather now. Anyway, thanks for watching.